today, we will see some misconceptions related to profit and loss. Misconception 1. A person purchased a table for Rs. 550 and sold it at a loss of 10%. What is the selling price of the table? Here, cost price is Rs. 550 and loss is 10%. That means, loss is equal to Rs. 10 by 100 into 550, which is equal to 55 rupees. Students often think that selling price is always greater than cost price. In order to get selling price, they add loss to cost price. This is a misconception which leads to the incorrect answer of Rs. 605. The correct understanding is that selling price can be lower than the cost price. In the given example, loss is given, that means selling price is less than cost price. So by subtracting loss from cost price, we obtain the selling price. Therefore, Selling price is equal to 550 minus 55, which is equal to rupees 495. So the correct answer is option 2. Misconception 2 A shopkeeper sold a book for rupees 80, on which he made a profit of rupees 30. Find out the profit percent for the shopkeeper. Some students try to find the profit or loss percent on selling price. That means they find the profit percent in the following way. Profit percent is equal to 30 by 80 into 100, which is equal to 37 and a half. But profit percent or loss percent is never calculated on selling price. Therefore, option 2 is incorrect. The correct understanding is that profit percent or loss percent is always calculated on cost price. Therefore, Profit percent is equal to profit by cost price into 100. We know the selling price, but we don't know the cost price. So let's find out the cost price. Since profit is equal to selling price minus cost price, cost price is equal to selling price minus profit, which is equal to 80 rupees minus 30 rupees, which is equal to rupees 50. Therefore, profit percent is equal to 30 by 50 into 100 which is equal to 60. This means the profit is 60% and your correct answer is option 1. Today, we have seen some misconceptions related to profit and loss.